What's up guys, Colby with Feel Free Kayaks and today we're gonna take out the Lure 11.5 V2. All right guys, Colby White Legs from Feel Free Kayaks here. We are just shoving off in the Lure 11.5 V2. Now this boat got some subtle but really useful updates uh, from its V1 predecessor. And uh, today we're in the Fire Camo uh, Lure 11.5. Uh, it is the standard. This boat does come in an overdrive, which typically I take out, but it wasn't too terribly windy. So I thought I'd go ahead and give it a paddling review and then we'll touch on the overdrive at another time. So uh, first things first, gravity seat, super comfortable. Uh, plenty of room. Uh, if you didn't see my Lure 10 V2 uh, vlog, check it in the up here maybe. Uh, check that out. It actually has the same cockpit configuration as the 11.5. It's just shorter and has less storage. So you can kind of compare the two there if that's something you're interested in. But uh, let's get out on the water, see if we can hopefully catch some fish and see how this, uh, this boat handles it. So one of the things I've always really liked about the Lure series is the Unitrack. So uh, for me, since I am pretty much always filming anything I'm doing, uh, the Unitrack holds my GoPros a lot of the time. And it uh, comes with these Unitrack accessory plates. And the Unitrack itself is really just a T-slot uh, that you can put accessories or any of that sort of stuff to. It's super convenient for cameras, but it's also like rod holders or uh, cell phone mounts or really anything. So a nice little touch on this boat that uh, I really do enjoy. As far as stability goes, I mean, the Lure series is pretty top notch. Um, I don't usually stand in boats and uh, the Lure series, I'm starting to get more comfortable, I'll say. Uh, you definitely get a lot of secondary stability um, and it's just really a comfortable platform for standing. I know a handful of guys that uh, they primarily stand and they use their paddle almost more as a push rod. So really good boat if sight fishing or standing up is something you're into. The gravity seat is also like second to none. Um, fully adjustable, super comfortable. Uh, really, probably, again, I'm gonna probably say this a lot, but another one of my favorite things about the Lure series. Uh, this one's also uh, outfitted with the beaver tail rudder. And so the foot pegs on this make steering really a breeze. And like right now I'm in pretty sheep, shallow water and uh, you just pull it up and kind of keep going about your way. Uh, really convenient. Go ahead and do the little cockpit tour of the uh, Lure 11.5. Uh, so you've got, uh, beyond my super white legs, you've got the uh, removable sonar pod, which I don't do sonar personally, so it just ends up being storage for uh, random baits or uh, a lot of the time snacks. Up there, you've got a little bit more dry hatch storage, which is nice. Again, those Unitrack rails that I mentioned with the uh, Unitrack accessory plate. Um, you've also got here, we've got the rudder, uh, tow pivot controls for the rudder on this one. If you did go with the upgraded um, overdrive system, then of course that switches to a hand control and your pedals would be there. So something to keep in mind. Um, again, you've got stand up leash here to help. You got a very wide open padded deck, which is super good for standing. Um, you've got uh, plenty of room. I usually use under the seat. Whoa. Under the seat, I usually throw Plano boxes, stuff like that. You do have a paddle park on the side here. And again, a lot of storage in the back. You can see I've got a crate bag back there. You've got rod holders. I mean, really, it's just anything you need to go fishing is uh, already outfitted on this boat. It's great. And again, as I mentioned, this boat is like super stable kind of the the pov look here again those super sweet white legs i'm cheating a little because i'm in pretty shallow water but again you would really have to try pretty hard to flip this boat which is uh really convenient for somebody who's new to standing and sight casting like i am so another little perk well guys final thoughts on the lure 11.5 v2 is uh i mean it's a great boat it's a great all-around boat uh, it's still light enough. You can kind of maneuver it around. It's got the wheel and the keel. You can transport it around yourself. Uh, it's super stable, super versatile, plenty of storage space. Uh, who's it for? Uh, you know, the avid angler, the guy who's looking to level up a little bit, the guy who's uh, looking to make sure he's got everything on a platform that maybe he could grow with. Um, you know, and people who like style because this fire camo is, is killing it. So that's the Lure 11.5 V2 from Feel Free Kayaks. Uh, a great all-around stable kayak fishing platform. Uh, really anything you could ask for in a kayak. 